cliche g'day folks and welcome back to Storm Meister's Rediscovered Mod Review Survival Thingy that I'm doing. This is the third and possibly, possibly last instalment of this mod review, this mini game mod review, mini game, mini survival mod review, English match. And um, I'm going to show you one thing that I tried to show you last episode and one other thing that goes hand in hand with that. So first and foremost, what we have to do, and we're going to get straight back into it, is I'm going to head down here and start mining. So we just need a couple of sticks just to make one lovely pickaxe because I got to go mining. Right, short and sweet, let's do this. So as you can see there guys, I'm at the Y level of 15. What I'm looking for uh, falls between the ground, the bottom of the, of, of the bottom, and I believe it's the Y level of 32. It is as common as gold, so it shouldn't take me too long I really shouldn't be using this iron pickaxe before it uh, before I kill it, should I? Shouldn't take me too long to find some, so let's speed this up. Okay, that was unexpected. Wait, where'd you go? It might be easier to find what I need in a little mini cave system, so this is probably quite good. Good timing. And we are still on level 15. Oh, oh that's not what I was looking for. That's what I, oh my god, okay. That's not what I was looking for, but um, never look a gift horse in the mouth. Here we have some diamonds, and so look at that diamonds to me. There's probably some more there. This is actually what I've been looking for. It's a shame I don't have the what am I looking at mod, but this is what I'm looking at, Ruby. So Rubies are the only other mod that have been added to this mod um, for Minecraft. 1.7.10 guys. I hope I have said that before. I'm pretty sure I have. Um, the Rubies are used for the next thing I'm going to show you guys, but hashtag no spoilers, I'm not going to give it away too early. So I might just continue mining for a bit and I'll come back at ya when I've got a little handful of them and we will take you on to the next step. Now, um, guys, I'm still down in this, uh, in this mine here and the water was attracting me this way, but can you hear that? That, that, um, I can't even explain it. There's another, well, there's the water. There's another sound. How low am I? Oh, I'm still at 14. I swear there's another sound coming. You might not get the surround sound on the video. There's another sound coming from, like, this direction. That's right, because I needed a little bit more coal. I swear! Can you hear that? Oh, freaking wicked! Well, it's not the new <laughs> mine shaft sound, is it? Hear that? Is that a mob? <gasps> <coughs> Hello, slime horse. Mother of God! Wow! And I got cow tipper from killing a slime horse. Oh, that's handy. Let's see if we can quickly find a chest. <laughs> or slowly. We could slowly find one through this water. And uh, see if there's anything extra from the mod review. <sighs> okay, pumpkin seeds and coal ain't gonna cut it. Can we see a chest? Always follow. Ah, and there's some more rubies. And a chest, yay. I'm pretty sure I'm going to need more than just three. Oh. <laughs> I should just shut up, guys. You know what? I'm just going to shut up and just going to put some <laughs> music to this. You guys watch, and things are just going to happen anyway. Here we go. This is something I've been wanting to show you guys. Nice. And we got some melons as well. So, this is our lantern. Now, you can place those down. They're quite lovely in your inventory when they're in the hot bar between one to nine they will light up as you walk see when it's out when it's just in my inventory no 
you don't get that. But look at that. It will light the stuff as you go. Which is... Oh, it just went out a bit. Oh, it's a bit flashy. You don't actually even have to hold it in your hand. That's, I knew that was going to be a dead end. And it will just take care of itself. So, I reckon how many rubies have we got? Eight rubies. Oh, I might just, I might go until I've got like 15 or something and I will um, come back at ya. Oh, you remember what I said about me just shutting up? Ah, <laughs> oh, so pretty. Now, the message from Stormmeister that there was no, because there was never any talk from Mojang about adding ruby tools or weapons, that's why they aren't in this mod. Um, but he has also said that if you have a mod that does allow uh, for craftable ruby or I guess it would be like gemstone type of um, weapons and items, that it is compatible. These rubies are compatible with any other mob, mob, any other mod that, um, that does have that. That's not the way I want to go. That's where I originally... Where am I? I'm lost. How can I? How the hell can I be lost? Really? Oh, there it is. Ah. All right. I'll come back at you guys again when I found the rubies. Fantastic. All right, guys. So I did get uh, 19 rubies, and it is night time. We are going to the Sky World. That is where we're going. That's where we were last time. I did fail in finding what. Oh, quick leave. I failed in finding what I wanted to find. This is such a rediscovered mod hack, doing it this way. Um, so, as I've been saying, here we go, as I've been saying, this is a, um, it's not just like a mini survival, because it's only a couple of episodes, but it's, it's a mod review as well. So, what I am going to do, seeing as I've shown you guys, I'm just going to let things render in a little bit because it's a little bit laggy, but that's alright. Because um, I have shown you guys what this sky world does look like, what I am going to do is I'm going to pop myself into creative and we are going to fly to find that place that we didn't find last time because um, I fell. If you guys remember, I fell. Uh, there'll be a, um, a link in the description below for the last episode, so if you didn't catch it, you can just go straight back there and see the derpiness of me. Um, but let's have a look at um, at this destination. And here it is, guys. Uh, you can see that we're about to go up there, but I'm not going to show you yet. It's taken a huge chunk out of that land just so it could fit in, um, which is quite groovy. It's quite groovy. But let's have a look, shall we? Ooh, it's a village! But it's not just any kind of village. Let's pop back into um, survival again. So we all rendered in. We all good? Behaving? Good. <sighs> What's that? What's that over there? Um, let's have a look at this guy over here. Is he going to come at me, bro? Yep, he's totally coming at me, bro. Oh, the lag may actually kill me. Haha. <laughs> oh dear god. Alright, everything's happening at once now. So, pigmen! Oh my god. No, fly! Yes. You nasty, nasty red dragon. Don't kill the village! It's gonna defeat the purpose of me showing the village. I'm not in, I'm not in survival anymore. Please don't kill the village. Alright, we're gonna have to do this really, really, really quickly. So, this here, this guy right here, this angry little character, was the original Steve. Uh, he was going to be what we were going to look like before we had proper skins. Uh, you can see the village is manned by pigmen. These are not zombie pigmen, these are pigmen. Oh, hello, hello, here's another fella. Here's another fella over here. I am sorry about the red dragon, guys, because it is really messing with my, um, with my FPS. Here we have Beast Boy. Uh, Beast Boy is running on the stop. He was also going to be an addition to the game originally. And there's two more. I saw one. Oh my god, dragon, stop. <gasps> no. No. Well, damn. Where is he? Oh. 
Okay. Well, that's ruined that, but I'll just have to tell you, behind these bars here, guys, a, the original green villager was being held prisoner. <sighs> you buggers. There he is. Uh, not the villager, this is the other guy. Um, but he was being held villager by... Held villager? Being held prisoner by the, um, by the pigmen guards. Here we have Black Steve. Now, I'm not really quite sure I uh, appreciate him being called Black Steve. Um, they could have given him like a better name, even if it was a stereotypical name, like Jerome or something like that. Or I don't know, but yeah. Black Steve, here we have Black Steve. And last but not least, our pretty little girl. As long as she hasn't been, I reckon she's been knocked off. Oh my god, Red Dragon, what have you done to me? <gasps> there she is. I had a feeling I saw her over this way. You guys might recognise her from my mod review. Uh, not from my mod review, from my mod carrot. I'm getting all flustered, Red Dragon. You're a bugger. This here is Rana. Here we have Rana. She's, um... Like, I'd have to kill Mr. Pigman here because he's going to try and hurt me as soon as I come out of um, survival. But Rana is a um, neutral mob. She would never try and hurt me. Uh, Steve, Black Steve and Beast Boy probably would. Uh, but Rana wouldn't dare. She wouldn't do that to me. You wouldn't do that to me, would you, Rana? No. No. Uh, and now I have no reason to show you the rubies. The rubies were to trade. Uh, but it looks like... Ah! The grand finale <laughs> has come. This last episode was a bit of a mishmash, but I got to show you some things that... Uh, that I didn't get to show you in the last episode. There's plenty more things to discover here for the Rediscovered mod. Um, head over the link again for this episode, for the second episode and the first. The link for the download is below. Do get involved with the mod. Have some fun. Play around with it yourself. Have a look at some of the things that uh, were going to get added to Minecraft, but then they decided to go in a different direction. I do have to go now, guys, but remember, say good day to your neighbour.